Howdy everyone, Chase here with Silencer Shop, and today we are talking about the CAT MOB or Mobster, and this is a nine millimeter silencer designed for use on pistol caliber carbines, PCCs, and submachine guns. What makes this can so special is that it uses laser powder bed fusion 3D printing, which gives it really good clarity on that 3D printing and allows them to do things that you just couldn't do with traditional machining, and it's optimized for that lower pressure nine millimeter round. In addition to nine millimeter, the MOB is also rated for use with subsonic 300 blackout and subsonic 86 blackout. So you can get a little bit of use on this on your rifles as well. The MOB uses diverge technology, which is gonna be similar to their surge bypass tech that you might know from their centerfire rifle cans. But diverge, while it does the same thing at lowering back pressure and making sure that sound and gas is trapped inside of the can and moving forward, is more optimized towards the lower end of pressure versus the centerfire high pressure rifle cans that use surge bypass. And just like those rifle cans, the MOB is available in two different mounting options, either the inbuilt QD TSFX Spooky mount that's going to include the Spooky One flash hider in half by 28. This is just a flash hider and it uses this nice mounting taper followed by 16 by one left-handed coarse threads to make sure that your silencer stays aligned and isn't coming off even in the highest rates of fire or your universal hub mount in 1.375 by 24. So this will be compatible with other aftermarket options and direct thread mounts. We had good luck with the dead air QD systems using their P series adapter ring. It also seems to work with the silencer co accessories but because of that internal taper and CAT's diverge technology making use of all of the interior diameter of this silencer, some hub mount accessories might not work with your CAT MOB. The MOB uses that 3D printing technology and it's printed from 100% titanium. What that's gonna do is allow the mob to stay nice and lightweight on your PCCs, but it also keeps it very strong for those lower pressure nine millimeter loads. So you're able to use titanium instead of the heavier things like stainless steel or Inconel, because nine millimeter is much lower pressure compared to centerfire rifles, this is plenty durable. You'll be able to shoot all day long without any problems. And that diverge technology does something really interesting that we noticed on the range. While we were shooting it, even after like a full mag through this AR9 or through our MP5, it was still fairly cool to the touch. It wasn't like, cold, but you, it wasn't so hot that you were burning yourself. You could pick it up and take it off the gun after 30 rounds. So that technology is working really well to keep this can cool and keep that operating pressure and operating temperature low. On the CAT MOB, you have a flash hiding end cap. So you don't have to worry about flash from unburnt powder on things like subsonic nine millimeter or 300 blackout. And it's also removable, which makes it super nice for when you go to clean this using CAT 206. You can open that up so that you can make sure that, that cleaning solution gets into all the nooks and crannies inside the silencer. So you make sure you get all that carbon and lead out so this thing stays at its peak performance throughout the life of the silencer. The MOB using that diverge technology to keep back pressure low was super nice. And as shooting these guns as a left-handed shooter, I super appreciated it. It kept the gas out of my face. Most of the gas and sound was traveling down range out of the barrel and not back into the action. It also made the guns feel a little bit smoother, especially in the case of this AR9, where you have that heavy buffer weight and heavy bolt moving back and forth. Not having so much pressure in the system, causing that to speed up was really nice. That made the gun shoot a lot softer. So keeps the gas out of your face, keeps your guns running a little bit smoother and cleaner. And it sounds amazing on nine millimeter subsonic and 300 blackout subsonic. The CAT MOB QD is 9.3 ounces and 7.74 inches long. The CAT MOB hub weighs in at 8.5 ounces and is 7.39 inches long. Both have a diameter of 1.65 inches. If you're looking for an ideal nine millimeter sub gun can, the CAT MOB is one to consider. I had a blast shooting it on the range and I think that you will too. If you have any questions about the CAT MOB or any of the other CAT products, go ahead and leave them in a comment below. As always, make sure that you're subscribed to the YouTube channel and to our newsletter so you get all the latest in suppressor news, deals, and info. And thank you guys so much for watching.